Yesterday I was on a walk with my son and uh, came across a little Pacific Wren and it was in a, a nicely wooded area so I decided today to go out and see if I could refine the little bird. I didn't have my camera on me, I was spending time with my son. So um, I'm off here to see if I can relocate this bird and get some good photos. Well, I made it to the spot where I saw the Pacific Wren yesterday, and I can't refind it so far. Um, I didn't really expect it to be in the same spot, but I was hopeful that maybe it would be. But um, I've seen one in here uh, another place in the last week, so if they haven't completely left the area, then there's a possibility I might still be able to find one. I'll just see. I'll keep looking. There's other animals here too. There might be, uh, I might come across a moose. Um, I had a, a American three-toed woodpecker on the drive-in and that was really cool. I was hoping he was gonna give me a nice photo op, but uh, he flew up into the top of the tree and didn't want to come down. So <laughs> that's what happens sometimes. But um, anyway, it's nice to be out here. It's a beautiful day. The search continues. So I'm walking these trails. I found a spruce grouse. This is so cool. He's just sitting on a spruce bough. His head is just in really beautiful light. I still haven't found the uh, Pacific Wren, but I'll take it. bird is a really handsome male and he's got his display out so oh, this is this is really cool what a great opportunity Things just got interesting. The bull moose just showed up. There he is. So I think I'm gonna follow this guy for a little while. He's a nice sized bull. I'm gonna have to switch lenses because I've got too much lens on for this guy. What a beautiful boy though. I think he's going down into the marsh. I'm gonna have to get ready. So it turns out there's five moose around. There's a, there's a decent sized bull. Um, there's a smaller bull and then there's two cows and a calf. And this one bull's right in front of me. It's just, a, he's a beautiful animal. He looks like he's kind of trying to intimidate the other smaller bull, but so far the other bull's just kind of hanging out there. Whew, this is awesome.
so uh, I had to switch out my lenses. I had my 200 to 500 on because I was expecting to do some bird photography. So I had to put on the uh, 70 to 200 for this guy. It's really incredible to watch these two massive creatures duke it out. Uh, they're not really doing any serious sparring. Uh, they're right in front of me, but uh, they're definitely playing around. Um, knocking antlers. Man, this is, this is so cool. What an experience. Well, I have to say that was pretty amazing, watching those two uh, giant creatures <laughs> square off. Uh, I got my heart racing, so that was fun. Um, but what a great opportunity. And living here in Alaska, there's so many opportunities like that. Um, just so much wildlife, birds, and stuff around. Uh, even the common species, you know, in the wintertime. Um, can be a challenge just to try to get those common species in something, uh, you know, interesting situations and whatnot. So as we move into winter, it's going to be um, one of the things that I strive for is trying to get interesting, uh, captivating photos of, of the bird species that are here. So, uh, but uh, you love days like this, you know, when things happen and uh, you get lots of action. So still haven't found that wren. That's okay. <laughs> it's all good. Because we're having fun here with moose and spruce grouse. So, well, I had an amazing time out here. It's been a really good day. And anytime I can get out in nature, away from people and cars and traffic and, you know, the cares of day to day life and just kind of, I don't know, I guess it's kind of my escape just to get out and get fresh air and, you know, just walk in the woods. That's what it's all about. It's, um, it's just good for the soul, you know. But that wraps up this trip. It was really fun. Um, came around a corner and saw spruce grouse right in a tree. That was pretty awesome. Got some uh, good shots of him. And then, and then uh, bull moose came right down into the trail. And uh, he went down into a kind of a swampy area where there was a few other moose another bull and they locked antlers and pushed each other around uh, it never really got too intense but it was really cool to watch um, so that was really awesome and then uh, i finished walking around the lake and just taking in the beauty and a uh, nice autumn day and trying to make the most of it so hey, it was awesome had a great time so yeah lots of fun and Thanks for watching. Thanks for joining me on this trip. Definitely a good time. All right, that'll do it for this one. So take care of yourself. We'll see you later.